For more than 15 years and 300 episodes, America's Next Top Model has consistently created meme-worthy moments and tons of model-on-model -model drama, and plenty of reality TV stars to boot. Though their high fashion fame doesn't seem to last very long, here are some former top model stars with very different lives and looks today. Annalie Tipton she struggled early on in Cycle 11, but Annalie Tipton quickly became a favorite with both the judges and fans when she learned how to integrate her figure skating experience into her modeling. Although Tipton placed third in her cycle, she's gone on to become one of the show's most successful contestants, changing up her look constantly as she pursues an acting career. Get on this high while you're filming. Tipton began acting in feature films with an appearance in 2011's The Green Hornet before landing a memorable role as the unlucky in love babysitter Jessica in the rom-com Crazy Stupid Love. Other notable parts include Mississippi Grind and the short-lived ABC series Manhattan Love Story. Mickey Sullivan She came out on top in Cycle 11, despite having to change her name early on to help Tyra avoid the confusion of having too many girls named Britney. Although Mickey Sullivan didn't have much modeling experience when she came on the show, she proved to be unnatural, using her short hair and androgynous look to blow away designers. Sullivan has done some modeling since the show ended, but she has focused mostly on her family, marrying MMA fighter Sam Alvey and having two children together. Mickey has also changed her look somewhat, relaxing her short dark bob in lieu of a more casual look with lighter blonde and red shades. Motherhood definitely suits her. Yaya DaCosta she came so close to winning it all on America's Next Top Model's third cycle, but Yaya DaCosta eventually lost out to Ava Pigford. DaCosta has still managed to build a successful career for herself as both an actress and a model. She started acting shortly after the show ended, eventually landing a series regular role on the soap All My Children. DaCosta has since booked roles in several films and TV shows. In 2015, she joined Chicago Med as a series regular, playing nurse April Sexton. I have so much respect for people who do this work and really Life. Although she's changed up her look many times since her top model days, DaCosta always finds a way to stand out. Kim Stoltz Kim Stoltz placed fifth on America's Next Top Model's fifth cycle and earned a guest spot on Veronica Mars during her time on the show. Since the contest, she's worked with MTV News and published a book, Unfriending My Ex and Other Things I'll Never Do, in 2014. Stoltz has since traded in the runway for an office, working for Bank of America Merrill Lynch. As she settles into a more traditional career, Stoltz has also gone for a more traditional look. Sophie Sumner the Brits took the crown on the America's Next Top Model British Invasion cycle thanks to the bubblegum pink-haired beauty Sophie Sumner, who used her edgy look to beat out the competition. That win, coupled with her previous work on Britain's Next Top Model, catalyzed a successful career in the industry. However, Sumner has since changed her signature look somewhat, going for a more mature dark blonde do that's a bit longer than the shortcut she rocked on the show. Sumner, who is good friends and former roommates with Harry Potter star Emma Watson, has also taken her talent to the small screen, appearing as a VJ and host on the video on demand service Music Choice. Whitney Thompson America's Next Top Model's first plus size winner, Whitney Thompson, has continued to rock her curves both in print and on the runway since she left the show. While Thompson is clearly still using everything Tyra has taught her and has even returned to the show for multiple guest appearances, she has dropped one thing that the outspoken host pushed on her light blonde hair. Thompson was given bleach blonde extensions on the show, and while she has kept the length, she's since stuck mostly to dark blondes and even browns. The glam gal has also started a family, getting married in 2014. Her wedding planning was featured on the TLC reality show Curvy Brides. Joanna House House was the second winner of America's Next Top Model, and she has built on her success from the show working as a brand ambassador for OPI and by appearing in ads for Sephora, Levi's, and Macy's. She has also started a family and frequently posts pics of her adorable son on Instagram. House has developed a much more sophisticated modeling style over the years, growing out her hair and embracing a more natural look. Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.